welcome to part 2 of the video of how to use a demo video about how to use microsoft teams uh, in taking up your uh, online exams uh, now let us continue from where we left now you have logged in once you log in you will be greeted with a page with a teams page or if you are not able to see this page you can click on the icon on the icon present in the left hand side menu bar say teams once you click on that you will be taken to the teams page teams for which you have been assigned or or for which your exams has been scheduled so teams is nothing but a uh, collection of students is a group which are many students who are going to take the same exam in this you can see the subject code and also the session of the exam since it is a re exam this is going to represent the subject code of what you have taken already and the session is november 2020 now once you click on this you will be created with the uh, post page in which uh, there will be a link to view our assignments which is nothing but your question paper you can either click on this or you can click if you click view on assignment it will be taken to your assignment page or you can even check in your grades in the grades you will be visited like this the schedule of the exam uh, what is the status when you visit first time it will be saying as not turned in but when you click on this it will tell us it will it will take you to the question paper page that is the reference material is the place where your question paper will be displayed in pdf or word document format you can download it you can click download or you can even view it online itself if you want so this is a sample question paper which i have uploaded for demo purpose uh, so but this uh, demo purpose once you view it you can visit the question paper write down all the questions answers for the questions as per university norms and given in the information booklet once you have done it you can add the answer scripts using the option called as add work you can upload this you can upload as a uh, you can upload the your uh, scanned answer scripts using this option here you have to select upload from this device and then i am going to upload a sample uh, another another answer scripts uh, for example let us say this is my answer in a word document once you have upload you will notice that a green line gets filled up completely and then you the done button will be enabled if everything is uploaded then you have to press done once you have done you can see what what is the thing you, what is the answers you have uploaded you can upload any number of sheets uh, as per university norms the question paper should be uploaded within 30 sheets as a single pdf with the subject code so your answer booklet you can even remove whatever you have uploaded for example a acu website if you go into acu website right and then click on the important updated information on re examination conducted during february 2021 you will be able to see the pdf in which instructions are given in what format you have to upload your question papers the candidate should upload jpeg or pdf of answer book within the prescribed time limit of 60 minutes the pdf should contain your registration number hyphen subject code okay so that is what is is the uh, expected Uh, required. If you are not following this logic, your answer scripts will not be evaluated. All the answers should be handwritten. It should not be typed at any point of time. Please follow these instructions given in the information booklet provided in the link as I told you. So, if I am going to upload it, so let me take a sample example. I am going to. sample example so let me say i have written my scripts and i am having it already so i wanted to uh, 
do it as per university norm so i have to put my register number say let us say 20 20 108 00 5 Zero five one, and then my subject code will be hyphen G E five one five three. Once this is done, you can you should upload it as a PDF. To upload it as a PDF, you can do it is open the document, and then say file, save as in the location where you want to save. You can save it as PDF. In the Word document, you have option to save it as PDF. It is available in Word. 2010 and above so i think most of the students will be able to do it so this is the example don't see that i have typed and uploaded it this is for just a demo purpose i'm showing you once i have done it i will go to my teams login and i will click add work and then i will choose upload from this device then i will go to the place where i have stored my pdf which contains registration number iphone subject code then say upload so you can see the upload is done once it says done it's done then it is very very important for you to click turn in if you do not click turn in it will be indicating your answers are not been submitted so it is it is important you click turn in once you click turn in the answers are script are you have you have submitted your answer scripts remember after the close time which says 7:30 am this time which is close time today at 7:30 am after this time you cannot turn in you cannot submit your answer scripts so please be careful and do it as per university norms and turn it in within the specified period if you are not able to do it then you will not be able you will not be considered as taken the exam so remember this is the schedule which is given by university norms so you should be uploading your soft copy that is pdf format or pdf format of your answer script within 130 pm if it is a forenoon session and before 6 pm if it is an afternoon session no submission no submission is allowed you cannot submit after 130 pm at any point of time and no request will be entertained by the office of acoe considering this uh, when you ask for extra time this is not allowed being a End semester examination. So this is a, a video which will, which explains you in detail how to access Teams. In the part one of the video, we saw how to access Teams, log in into Teams. In part two of video, we saw how to download your question paper and also how to upload your answer scripts within the specified time. Thank you, and all the best for your exams.